In this video, we are going to talk about top 10 best places to visit in Mexico. So before starting this video like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for future updates. Mexico is a well-liked tourist destination because of its stunning beaches, delectable cuisine, festive culture, and historic pyramids. Mexico is a colorful and contrasted country. During the day, resort cities provide access to jungles resounding with howler monkeys and birds, while peaceful historical settlements are reached from crowded beaches. From majestic mountains, distant deserts are reached. Spanish haciendas are located close to traditional Pueblo homes. Outside of contemporary metropolises, Mayan city ruins have been discovered. Here are the top 10 best places to visit in Mexico. Number 10. Palenque. Palenque is a well-known Maya city that thrived about the 7th century, hidden away within the thick jungle of Chiapas state. The archaeological site contains some of the outstanding Mayan carvings, sculptures, and architecture despite being considerably smaller than Chichen Itza or Calakmul. Visitors can tour a number of enormous temple and palace complexes in Palenque. These are particularly well-preserved in general. The magnificent hieroglyphics and bas-reliefs have revealed much about the the location and the people who formerly lived there, as well as their enigmatic mythology. The Temple of Inscriptions, a memorial to Hannah Pakel, the most illustrious ruler of Palenque, is the most striking building. The largest and most impressive pyramids on earth can be seen in Teotihuacan, which is only 50 kilometers northeast of Mexico City. The city later developed into one of the most impressive and significant towns in the Americas, despite the fact that its beginnings and the identities of its founders are buried in mystery. Number 9. Copper Canyon. The Copper Canyon is a network of six canyons that together measure larger than the Grand Canyon in the United States. It was so named due to the copper-green color of the canyon walls. This canyon system, which can be found in the state of Chihuahua Sierra Madre, features some of the most breathtaking landscapes in all of Mexico. With numerous varieties of plants, flowers, and wildlife, as well as waterfalls and fascinating rock formations like the San Ignacio formations that resemble people and animals, Copper Canyon is rich in biodiversity. The region is home to a number of classic Mexican communities, such as Creole, Hidalgo de Parral, Batopolis, and Yurique. There are numerous routes to visit Copper Canyon, but the Chihuahua Pacific Railway, also known as El Cheap, is by far the best. The circuit traverses 86 tunnels and 37 bridges while ascending up to 2,400 meters, 7,900 feet, above sea level and passing through some of Copper Canyon's most breathtaking scenery. Number 8. Guanajuato. The capital of the same named state, Guanajuato, is charming. Guanajuato's drawcards include cobblestone streets, sidewalk cafes, and some of North America's most breathtaking Baroque architecture. Additionally, the city features a system of underground tunnels that function as highways, making it truly unique in the world. Guanajuato, which was established in 1559, immediately gained notoriety for its gold and silver mines. La Valencia, one of the richest silver mines in the world, is one of the mines that may still be visited today. The Church of San Cayetano, which is richly decorated with silver and gold, is located next to the mine. The city is a great location to listen to authentic mariachi music. Number 7. Cancun. Cancun, a well-known tourist destination on Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula's Caribbean coast, offers a whole vacation package with amazing beaches, a world-class hotel district, Mayan ruins, contemporary attractions, and a vibrant nightlife. The island's biggest tourist draws are Cancun's stunning beaches and year-round ideal weather. These beaches provide a variety of water sports and residents selling items along its 14 kilometers of pristine white sand and turquoise waters. With its historical architecture, eateries, marketplaces, bars, and clubs, the downtown district, known as El Centro, has a more traditional Mexican beat. Visitors will not be short of options in Cancun's vibrant nightlife, which includes everything from pubs and nightclubs to dance halls and dinner cruises. Number 6. Oaxaca. Oaxaca is the state's capital and is situated in a valley beneath the Sierra Madre Mountains. It is a well-liked tourist destination in southern Mexico because of the colonial architecture, archaeological sites, good weather, and peaceful ambience. 
The lovely town square, or Zocalo, in Oaxaca is where visitors can see stunning colonial structures like the Santo Domingo Church, visit museums, browse gift shops, and unwind at an outdoor cafe. You may explore a number of ancient monuments near the city, like Monte Alban. The ancient Zapotec capital city was located at Monte Alban, which was perched on a mountain. Impressive views of the valley are available from this location. Midlas site is intriguing due to its geometric pattern covered walls. Number 5. Mexico City. Mexico City, the nation's capital, is one of the largest cities on earth and is home to several ethnic groups from all over the world. This enormous city serves as not just Mexico's most significant political and cultural hub, but also one of Latin America's most significant financial hubs. Additionally, Mexico City is home to one of the biggest and oldest colleges in North America. Mexico City does not have any beaches, but there are still a lot of fun things for visitors to see and do. Famous sites including the Plaza de la Constitución, the Metropolitan Cathedral, the National Palace, and the ruins of an old Aztec temple are abundant in the historic center. Mexico City is one of the top cities in the world for arts and culture, with hundreds of museums, galleries, and performing arts facilities. The city has numerous public parks, including the magnificent Chapultepec Park, as well as the must-see Zachamilco Floating Gardens. Number 4. Puerto Vallarta. Puerto Vallarta, a well-known tourist destination, is located on the Bay of Banderas in the Mexican state of Jalisco. This charming town is surrounded by stunning beaches, mountains covered in thick vegetation, colonial architecture, world-class resorts, fine dining establishments, and dozens of nightclubs. Golden Sand Beaches, which are the city's main draw, provide relaxation and water sports including sailing, kiteboarding, and deep-sea fishing. Due to the fact that Puerto Vallarta is a well-known diving location, there are numerous dive shops scattered across the beaches. Dolphins and giant manta rays can be spotted here, and between December and March, humpback whales can be sighted. The Malacan, a stunning boardwalk lined with stores, eateries, and bars, is a wonderful spot to shop, dine, socialize, take in street entertainers, and take in the ocean. Outside of the city, visitors can explore papaya and mango farms, as well as peaceful fishing communities and hidden coves. The mountains and lush hills offer pathways for horseback riding, hiking, and ziplining in addition to canopy and ziplining excursions. Number 3. Teotihuacan. The largest and most impressive pyramids on Earth can be seen in Teotihuacan, which is only 50 kilometers northeast of Mexico City. The city later developed into one of the most impressive and significant towns in the Americas, despite the fact that its beginnings and the identities of its founders are buried in mystery. The expansive metropolis was at its height in the first part of the first millennium, with innumerable structures, enormous temples and palaces, squares, and stadiums. Even though it had already been abandoned by the time of the Aztecs, they gave the ruinous city the name Teotihuacan, which means birthplace of the gods, since they thought the cosmos was founded there. The power of the ancient Mesoamericans, though its star had long since faded, is still on display at the vast and astounding archaeological site. Along the renowned Avenue of the Dead, you may see houses and murals that have been conserved well. Its two most notable attractions are the enormous Pyramid of the Sun and Pyramid of the Moon. Number 2. Tulum. In Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula, on a rocky outcrop overlooking the Caribbean, lie the Tulum ruins, the remains of a fortified Maya city. The site lacks the elegance of some other well-known Mayan ruins since it is small in scale and was constructed when the Mayan culture was in decline during the post-classic period. However, the backdrop of a tropical beach makes this a special location that should not be missed. The 25 feet, 7.5 meters, tall El Castillo, the castle, perched above the cliff, is the most impressive structure in Tulum. It was formerly painted and stuccoed over. It appears that a modest shrine served as a beacon for approaching canoes. Tourists combine a trip to the Mayan ruins with a plunge in the Caribbean on the beach below, where the canoes came ashore. Number 1. Chichen Itza. The most well-known, frequently visited, and most impressive of the many Mayan ruins in the nation is Chichen Itza, which is located on the Yucatan Peninsula. 
This is somewhat odd considering that its most renowned temples exhibit substantial influences from other central Mexican civilizations rather than the conventional classic Mayan architecture. The amazing archaeological ruins were chosen as one of the new seven wonders of the world despite the oppressive heat and throngs of tourists, which can turn off some visitors. The once great city, which was constructed between the 9th and the 12th centuries, spans a vast area, and many of its structures, temples, and palaces are still in astonishingly fine condition. These exhibit a wide range of various architectural styles and provide an intriguing window into Mayan culture. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from us again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.